Okay, so today I'm going to show you how to review and start a verifier program using the V6CF controller. So the first thing we want to do, we want to make sure we have the correct program in. So I'm going to press recall under the verifier programmer. And user 5 is the one I want, so we'll type in 5, press enter. Okay, so now we'll return back to the idle screen. So the next thing we want to do is review the program to make sure that all the parameters are correct. So we'll press review program here down at the bottom and it's going to run through all of the settings for each segment as well as the alarm and hold times for you. So we'll press the review program button. Now it's going to tell you user 5, the number of segments is 4, the ramp rate for segment 1, temperature for segment 1, and hold time for segment 1. And now it's going to go through segments 2, 3, and 4. Because remember we have it set for 4 segments. Okay, so now we're at segment number 4 settings. So once it gets through all of those, now it tells you the delay is set for zero, the alarm is set for all nines, error codes are on, and the controller has fired nine times. So the, once all that information goes by, it'll go back to the idle screen. Now if everything is set the way you want, we can go ahead and start the firing. If not, you'll need to go through the programming sequence for the very fire. Um, but let's just say everything's set correctly. So we'll go ahead and press the stop start button. You'll see it turn on. And then you should hear the relays click and the elements turn on. And that's pretty much it for starting a firing. Pretty simple. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and stop the firing. At, you know, at any time you can always press the stop start button and it will stop the firing. And you see stop go across the screen and it returns back to idle. That's it for now. But remember to like us on Facebook, sign up for our e-newsletter, or check our website for more information and tips. Thanks!